All right, so this has been a lot of fun. This is my first time really doing a video project like that, where it's just all me, what I decide, and especially putting it directly on the internet. I've only really made videos for like personal events with family or church or something. So making something specifically for YouTube has definitely been a little intimidating and it still kind of is. So just excited to see where this goes. So doing this first review was interesting because there was just a lot to set up, especially for the first time. Uh, I had to figure out my set. I ended up using a blanket as the backdrop for my video, along with some cutouts and things from a local Zerkers. And it took quite a while to figure out how I was gonna set that up and where I wanted everything to be. And my little green screen that I'm putting clips on is literally just my laptop with some green tablecloth and some like um, film strip um, liners around the edge of it. And doing that made it really easy for editing, putting the clips just on that instead of just having kind of floating or something. I do have a good amount of the clips that are over the top of everything, just because it's not good to have it on my face the entire time, especially when I'm talking about the film. But yeah. And setting up the lighting equipment in the apartment was kind of interesting. I've never really played with lighting equipment before. I'm doing it for a lot of projects, including this one, for the next couple months. But yeah, it was my first time really doing it, and lighting yourself is very difficult. I had a roommate come in and stand in for me for a little bit, but besides that, yeah, it was just mostly me figuring it out. I would like change the lights, take a picture of myself, and look at it and compare it, and it was a lot. And then recording it and going off the script was kind of difficult, uh, trying to memorize everything really didn't work. I definitely think time-wise I'm gonna try to figure out better what I need to have figured out beforehand like to say on camera versus what I can just say in a recording and add in later. I did also get to meet with my supervisor for the first time uh, about the project itself and what I'd recorded instead of just like hey how are you thanks for doing this um, and he gave me a lot of advice on what I should do um, with my lighting and where I was positioned and that kind of thing. So I'm definitely going to be implementing those next time. But for this time, I'm pretty proud of my video thus far. It's uploading and everything, so definitely excited about that. And I'm really excited to see how this project goes. It's been really interesting setting this up for the first time. I've never really done a project like this before and I've kind of always wanted to. I watch a lot of film reviews on YouTube and they're some of my favorite things to watch and it's really interesting and I love discussing films. So it'll be fun to see uh, how much I like this or how well it goes. So far I think I did pretty good with this review. I'm not sure how much views it's going to get. It's on the 2008 Speed Racer film and it kind of bombed when it came out. It's getting a resurgence lately. So I'm hoping the video will get more views because of that, but other than that, there's not much to it. And I will say one thing that was pretty difficult for me was making a thumbnail for the video. I didn't notice until I was like almost ready to upload it that I didn't have that and that's a good thing to have because otherwise YouTube will just take a random shot of your video and you might look funny on it. So I had to figure out how to do that and I went on Canva and they have like a thing that's like automatically okay this is the dimensions you need and that kind of thing for a YouTube thumbnail but yeah it took a lot like good half an hour an hour to do and I just that was something that popped up that I wasn't expecting so I definitely know that for the next couple videos but I'm definitely excited to see how this project goes I hope I enjoy it I would really hate to have done this and find out oh this is actually pretty horrible so far, I'm just kind of exhausted from this one, but we'll see how the rest of the project goes.